A-list power drummer is an intelligent drum instrument that contains both patterns and drum kits. And it's very similar to A-list studio drummer. It just has a different set of patterns and sounds, but the basic design is actually much the same. So if I press a single key on my MIDI keyboard, I can trigger a drum pattern. Now that's a loop, but it's actually a MIDI based loop. It's not a sampled loop. And the fact that you get MIDI control over the different loops means that they're not set in stone. So if I use the black keys, I can trigger things like starts, ends, fills, and breakdowns. If I use the white keys, I can trigger verse and chorus elements. To make things keep playing without me having to hold a key, I can press the hold button. I can change the speed of the loop. This is all relative to my host tempo, of course. Speed it up. That's really useful because that enables you to vary the tempo of the loops without drastically changing your project tempo, which would mean that other things played much too quickly or much too slowly. I can, of course, pick a preset or I can change my style to Latin rock, for example. And I can play with the swing of the part. I can make it play slightly behind or ahead of the beat with the feel control. And I can control the tightness so I can make it really loose. Or more tight. In the source section on the left, I can change the way that the kit sounds. So I can change between different kit types. And I also have an individual volume control for each of the virtual mics on my kit. Everything from hi-hat and ride down to overheads and room. So if I play a loop, first thing I can do is change the kit type. And then I can do things like submixing the drums. I can also change the mix settings in this kind of preset mix section here. And this applies a bunch of processing to the signal internally. And that has a variable amount dial as well. And like Studio Drummer, if I move down my MIDI keyboard, these drums are all available as individual hits that I can just play like any regular MIDI drum kit so I could sequence my own parts. If I spin around the back of the module, I've got individual mono audio outputs for some of the drums and stereo for others so I can route these out into the mixer or into the rack to process separately. I also get CV gate in and out for all the different drum elements. <laughs> 